My name is Chase. I work at Easy Tiger Tattoo Vietnam. I've been tattooing for 10 years. When I was 16, 17, me and my boys want to form a band and having tattoos is another thing to make her look like a rocker. But it was illegal and expensive for us to get a tattoo back then. We were really upset leaving the studio. I don't remember how it led to the decision, but we came to an agreement that I will learn how to tattoo and we all will get free tattoo. And just like that, I became a apprentice. For the first two years besides school, all I did were focus on drawing and practice on face paint. When I was 18, I had my first tattoo and so had the boys. The one I choose is a traditional eagle. I remember the moment I saw that design. I honestly didn't know what style it is. I just have to have it. I moved to the city at 19 and enrolled in Fine Art Uni and I wanted to become a painter at the time. I didn't touch any customer on tattoo I did since 18 was from a friend. When I reached the professional program in oil paint, I needed the money for material. So I tried to make money out of tattooing and I was doing everything that walked into the door. And to get more customers, I started doing more research about tattoo. Only then I knew that the first one I pick up for myself is old school. Before I knew it, it became something I wanted to do. I even do my graduation assessment about tattoo history. I'm now known as a traditional tattoo artist. When I first decided on following this story, it was difficult. No one was doing it. Six years ago in Vietnam, they were mostly oriental, realistic artists. Felt like I was swimming on dry land. But it's blooming now. I have more companions and competition, which is really important for me to keep pushing myself forward. I believe drawing and painting every day is crucial to keep you involving and keeping whatever style you are following in shape. And it's definitely a hard thing to do. You need to be strict to yourself, set out some rules to follow every day. It will create a routine and a routine will make you a professional. I apply on art form. The most beautiful is for Mother Earth, paintings, movie scenes, songs, even. But the real inspiration comes from working process. 
when you get a hold of it, every drawing and painting you make will show your characters. So when a customer choose you to be their artist, it cause they see a little bit of themselves through the art you make. And so my customer and like my friends, somehow we all have something in common, which make my daily working process very enjoyable. In tattoo, American traditional have a big impact on me. Bold lines, solid colors, visually impressive. You can easily spot it from across the street. And with traditional tattoo, even a simple thing like a rough could look really cool. When I was in school, a teacher told me that the most beautiful drawing is a try drawing. It's so innocent and it makes everybody happy looking at a try drawing. And American traditional is somewhat like that. It can be symbolic, pictorial or simply decorative. Simple yes, so artists. It's the art of stylized. And one of the most important thing for me to follow this style is that it age better with time and to add the aging spy to it coin machine is a go to I try lots of machine over the year but coins give tattoo a rigid look which I believe is how a tattoo should look I still enjoy some of the rotary but tend to look for a rotary that works like a coin I use different types of coil for each process of tattooing big lines, small lines, black shading, colors and I enjoy it very much With Koi, I can adjust to how I want them to work best for me. I only have machine from brand, but I really love to travel more and get those handmade Koi machine from different traditional tattoo artists to be able to learn more, to see how they make, build a perfect machine for themselves. Tattoo industry definitely changed compared to where I first started. There are more artists in various signature style. We have access to more tattoo supply than we were in the past. We have annual tattoo convention where we were able to meet with foreign artists. We get to talk and learn more about how tattoo industry works in different countries, how each culture affects their ways of making a tattoo. So when you look at the tattoo, 
you can guess where and who it from. I really hope the pandemic will leave us soon so then I can start travel again. Tattoos in my bright joy and the thing that I want to do for the rest of my life 